Next year, the Fortuner SUV, which is Toyota's best-selling model, will debut a new generation. Thailand will be the first country where the new SUV model is introduced, then other nations. Welcome, automotive enthusiasts, to an exciting preview of the all-new 2023 Toyota Fortuner. Next year, Toyota's best-selling SUV is set to make a grand entrance with a brand new generation. Thailand will have the privilege of being the first country to witness the launch, followed by other nations worldwide. Get ready for a thrilling update packed with incredible features and enhancements. Now, let's get started with the details of the highly anticipated 2023 Toyota Fortuner. New body panels and extensive visual alterations will be made to the 2023 Toyota Fortuner. Now let's move on to one of the major updates, the TNGAF platform, which will replace the current IMV architecture and serve as the foundation for the new Toyota Innova High Cross, which is scheduled to go on sale in early 2023. SUVs from Toyota, the Global Tundra Sequoia and Land Cruiser, are built on the TNGAG platform, which allows for wheelbase lengths of up to 4,180 mm. The new design will enable the engine carmaker to save expenses and development time while realizing considerable scale savings. The new Fortuner's engine is a 1GDFTV, 2.8-liter diesel that benefits from mild hybrid technology and has an integrated starter generator. According to reports, the car manufacturer will call the diesel hybrid powertrain the GD Hybrid. The 2023 Toyota Fortuner will be significantly more feature-rich than the current model thanks to the new hybrid powertrain, which will increase the SUV's fuel efficiency. Additionally, the regenerative braking system will collect kinetic energy during braking or deceleration to provide additional torque during acceleration. The Advanced Driver Assistance System, often known as the ADASH, which includes automated emergency braking and blind spot recognition, may be offered with the SUV. Auto Parking Assistance Forward-facing adaptive cruise control with lane departure and collision warning Features An electric power unit will replace the current hydraulic steering wheel. The vehicle stability control system will also be included with the new Fortuner. The new TNGAF platform will serve as the foundation for the next-generation Innova High Cross. What makes this platform unique? This platform is shared by Toyota and Lexus, who use it for the Land Cruiser LX. Toyota will also incorporate a new mild hybrid configuration in the new Fortuner. In this setup, the new Fortuner will come with an alternator that helps with acceleration and provides power at lower RPMs. Toyota as a brand is not known for having contemporary features, but it is working to change that perception, as we have seen with the new Toyota High Cross. As a result, we might see the new Fortuner receive the same treatment, including wireless phone projection, a panoramic sunroof, a new instrument cluster, and a 360-degree setup. Price Now that the Innova High Cross has Toyota Safety Sense, the fundamental question of whether the new Fortuner will be less expensive than the existing model is unlikely to be answered. First of all, the car will use the TNGAF platform, which will increase the price. Additionally, the mild hybrid configuration will be costly. Finally, Toyota will be adding various new features, so we anticipate that the new Fortuner will have a price increase based on the difference. The Toyota Fortuner's price range varies depending on the trim level you select, starting at $49,000 and going up to $62,900 for the most recent year the model was produced. The model range is available in the following body types. Toyota plans to launch the new Fortuner sometime in 2023, but the first Toyota will be launching the new Fortuner in Thailand. Starting with the interior engine transmission specifications listed below, keep in mind that it is primarily a 4WD off-roading vehicle, which aren't often built to be luxurious, but it features a leather-accented interior and a steering wheel with a wood grain finish. The most recent edition of the Toyota Fortuner is equipped with LED headlights and daytime running lights, and it has a maximum towing capability of 3,100 kilos, 17-inch alloy wheels, Android Auto, and Apple CarPlay. Hues include graphite, silver, and glacial white, Saturn Blue, Phantom Brown, and Eclipse Black. The Toyota Fortuna has seven seats, and the two in the back can be configured to fold up to the sides of the boot to fit your needs. With all seats upright, the boot volume is 200 liters. 
When the third row is folded, it increases to 716L. And when the second and third rows are flat, you have 1080L. The Toyota Fortuner offers performance play in a variety of versions and body types that are driven by diesel fuel kinds. It has an estimated fuel consumption starting from 7.6L 100 km for SUV diesel 4. The latest year the model was manufactured the Toyota Fortuner has a number of different wheel and tire options when it comes to tires these range from 265 by 65 R17 for SUV. In 2022 the Fortuner accelerates from 0 to 100 km per hour in around 10 seconds. The new Fortuner will continue to be fitted with a familiar 2.8-liter diesel engine currently good for 150 kilowatts and 500 newton meters. But the big change will be the addition of a 48-volt mild hybrid system that will not only reduce fuel use and emissions but should also deliver a power boost on takeoff for quicker acceleration it means the pieces of Toyota's diesel-diesel-electric-electric electric puzzle are finally falling into place with Japanese media reporting a 2023 launch has been on the table. Since last year in fact, Toyota in Australia has been actively considering diesel-electric technology for its traditionally diesel-powered. Range telling the media last year that the tech would be a solution for those particularly wedded to diesel we are aware that certain individuals are extremely devoted to diesel. For instance, some farmers keep diesel on their properties, it's more convenient, or you live in a place where you can't get gasoline, according to Rod Ferguson, the brand's regional general manager of product planning and development. Both of those approaches should be seriously considered for the reasons stated above, and we are already doing just that. It is theoretically possible, and there are undoubtedly ongoing conversations when it comes to reducing our carbon dioxide emissions. And there you have it, an in-depth look at the upcoming 2023 Toyota Fortuner. With its new design, advanced hybrid powertrain, and an array of innovative features, this SUV is set to redefine the driving experience. Stay tuned for more updates as we approach the official release date. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for the latest automotive news and reviews. Thank you for joining us today, and we'll see you next time.